All right, guys. I'm going to show you how to upgrade one of the uh, cheese uh, PK80 motors here. This is what I'm doing. Basic port job, right? All right, you're going to want to knife all that. Um, now, with these huge Mondo transfer ports, okay, these things are just huge. But when it's opened on the inside through the cylinder, it's still the stock sized opening. And if you can see down there, you've got about two millimeters or three millimeters that you can chop out of the cylinder to make it this wide right here. You lose about three or four millimeters. So what you do, what I did is I took some heavy duty duct tape to protect the chrome. And what you want to do, it's on the exhaust side. Now the pins, uh, the gaps for the piston rings, they're, they're both on the intake side on this side. So everything you're going to be working on is on the exhaust side of the port. And you're going to want to kind of get in there and widen that fucker out um, to the stock. See that? How I got it in there? I haven't gone all the way. See that little lip in there? I don't know if you could see that, but uh, it's going to let a whole lot more air into this fucking bad boy. So that's just one of the upgrades um, that I'm doing to these Mondo transfer ports. <laughs> no. um, but yeah, that's it, man. Fucking killer motors, dude. Right on. So this is what we got here. We got the PK80 from uh, Cheese Fickenworth. Um, Everything looked fucking killer on this thing. Okay, the transfer ports were huge. Um, it comes with the speed carb without that gay uh, uh, fuel shutoff valve um, that always breaks. So that's pretty killer. Um, that's how I do my universal mounts. A little uh, mod, but it works a lot better that way. Um, it's going on a... It went on a fat bike from California. We're uh, representing Cali here, born and raised. That's how we do this. But uh, this bike probably has about 10 miles on it. Um, I just tuned it up. Let's go rip it up.